Okey pokey, I'm back, and it is time to look around. No, that's good to know. It's time to look around Arya's sort of temporary, temporary base camp. Wow, everyone seems to know my name around here. Well, I suppose Vatarians would know my name after I destroyed uh, their homeworld. Yeah, sorry about that. But anyways, let's look around. Uh, Human. Ah, Vorcha. I have a name. He just said it. Ah, Vorcha. The name is Shepard. But anyway, let's look around our temporary base camp before more people cut me up. One more try. Crap. What's the trouble here? Power inverters are shorting, trying to find a workaround, but no go. They can probably be scrounged up somewhere on Omega. If you come across a set of carry inverters, bring them back here. I'll see what I can do. Will do, will do. You kind of remind me of the mechanic on, uh... <laughs> On uh, Tuchanka, where we had to find those stabilizing something or others for the uh, the Mako, or at least their version of the Mako, and then he got blown up when we were curing the genophage, which is just a shame. Although that Krogan couldn't make his head go 360 like you could, that was insane. There's some Exorcist stuff over here on Omega. Arya wants to talk to you. All right, fair enough. There's a weapon bench. Don't won't be needing that. Nyrene, no, you don't want to chat. Yeah, so you go around here, this is kind of like a makeshift, makeshift of Normandy. You've got your weapon bench, you've got your armor locker. All that sort of good stuff. I'm giving up. New inverters are the only answer. Alright, buddy, I'll be back. I'll get you some soon, don't worry. Rock. Rock, you there? I swear, if you don't answer soon... Finally. Where are you? You don't know? Seriously? Look, just check your Omni tool for the station schematics. What do you mean your Omni tool is broken? Rock, that's not good. I... Right. I'm not helping here. I'm sorry. Look, I'll just talk you back to the bunker, okay? If these Omni tools broken, how are they communicating? I thought they communicated through their Omni tool. Curiouser and curiouser. Anyway, before I talk to Arya... Alright, you don't need to shout. <laughs> before we go back to Arya, see what else there is to see around here. You have a moment. What is it? I've been tasked with increasing this command center's control of Omega's operating systems. I've hacked surveillance on many decks, tapped various internal communication conduits, but I can only reach so far. There are terminals in Cerberus-controlled areas, and... Well, you could get your hands on them. When you find these terminals, a simple input code will give me access privileges and more influence on station systems. Easy enough. Good. I'll keep an eye on my board, and I'll let you know when my codes are activated. Thanks. Okay, we'll do, trainer. I mean, um, <laughs> whatever your name was. Man, you just, you're just like a white trainer. You were just... <laughs> the voices and the way... It wasn't just the voice. It wasn't just a British accent. It was the way they spoke. Just they... a reminder, Commander. When you find Cerberus terminals, please input my access code. Thank you. And the way they speak was just way too similar for my liking. Files are going to be tight. If we hadn't lost that shipment... You mean if we hadn't lost that ship and those people? Well, yeah, that too. This area is still unsecured. Off limits for now, Commander. All right, fair enough. Enough dilly dallying. Let's go speak to Aria. As how are we looking? All systems operational. Full Omega schematics coming online now. Let's take a look. I see. Shepard, those force fields we saw. The General has them set up everywhere. He's controlling access across the station. What are these dark areas? Many sections of Omega are powered down. I'm betting power is being siphoned to run those force fields. Find the source. Priority one. And we'll need a full tactical assessment of all Cerberus positions. I'll get on it. Shepard, we have work to do. Our losses were significant. We can't field an army large enough to face down Cerberus. And we need to find allies. Story of my life. We've confirmed there is a Merc gang that's still active. The Talons are resisting the occupation. Not my first choice, but... They're all we've got. 
Yeah, true, true. If they're the only ones left. I mean, in saying that, you did give the Blood Pack, the Eclipse, and the Vo and the uh, Blue Suns all to me. So I'm not surprised there's uh, only one Merc group left. But I've got to say, I've just got to laugh at, uh, when Shepard said, we need to find allies. And he was like, story of my life. <laughs> it's true. Seems like Shepard, all he's ever done is tried to make friends and get people for his calls. So, hell, you're the number one guy to go through for this. Then it's time to play Diplomat. And if the current leader won't join us, the next one will. Sorry to interrupt. What is it? I turned away for a second to offload supplies when I looked back. You lost her. Well, I... We're locked down. She's gotta be here somewhere. This bunker has secret access points to other parts of the station. Unfortunately, Nyreen knows them. Damn it, Bray. If I wasn't already short on manpower. We have to focus on getting the Talons on board. Shepard, I'll meet you at the Armory exit when you're ready to go. But don't keep me waiting. <laughs> don't keep me waiting? Well, I might just go have a look around the Keep station again. The panels. I'll cross-reference with my station schematics to try and figure out where you are. I... What? Ruck, I can't find a single reference to that location. No, I'm not joking. There's nothing remotely funny about this. Only you could get lost like that. I don't even know how you do it. Hey, I'm just saying, as skills go, that one's pretty impressive. With a name like Ruck, I'm thinking that's either a Turian... Uh, I don't know, Turian, Krogan, or Batarian. I don't know, it just seems like quite a masculine, kind of over-the-top, <laughs> over-top masculine name, but... New inverters are the only answer. True, alright, let's go meet Arya by that, uh, by that gate, but before we do, let's see if there's any more... Let's see if we can have some story time with Arya. Yes, what is it? Got a minute? We need to get going, but what's on your mind? Quite a few things, evidently, quite a few things. First off, why do you tell me the history between you and Nyreen? It seems like there's more to Nyreen than meets the eye. You mean her disappearing act? Honestly, I'm not concerned. If it was anyone else, I'd want blood, but Nyreen's a variable I can control. She believes in a code of ethics. She oozes virtue. You two must have made an interesting pair. Opposites attract, right? Our connection was powerful but doomed. Nyreen demonstrated zero flexibility. She couldn't put up with the challenges of my life. That's all you're getting out of me on this subject, Shepard. Anything else? I don't know. You said that you're not too worried about her disappearing, but you seemed pretty worried when she disappeared. I mean, hell, you threatened to kill Bray if you weren't low on manpower. Tell me about this Merc gang we're looking to enlist. They're drug runners and cutthroats, but they're highly organized. That sets them apart. They appear more civilized than, say, the Blood Pack, but at their heart, they're just as dishonorable. We'll have to appeal to their lust and greed to get and keep them in line. Anything else you need to know? Uh, to be honest, it sounds just like the way uh, things run before when we were uh, recruiting Archangel or Garrus. When we had to go around and talk to all the Merc gangs, it just looks like I'm going to have to uh, so <laughs> revamp some of my past skills when I did that. Tell me more about Petrovsky. He presumes to sit on my throne, that's all that matters. I get that you hate him, Arya, but I need to know who we're up against. Alright, I'll admit he's not like other Cerberus operatives I've encountered. He's smart, thinks outside the box, very hard to predict. He's like his boss, no matter who suffers and no matter the cost, he stops at nothing. To defeat him, we have to be prepared to do the same. Is the cross-examination over because time is of the essence? Nah, you know Shepard, there's a crisis going on. He does like to chit-chat. Hell, let's sit down, put our feet on, have a cup of cocoa. <laughs> let's get to know the real Arya. Once we recruit the talents, how do we reach the general? I'm working on it. His command center set up an afterlife. No doubt a deliberate move to piss me off. Rise above it. Now, let it fuel you, Arya. Make that rage the thing that makes him go get him. Although, do we... <laughs> we've seen what she likes when she gets mad. I mean, I don't think we're... Uh... <laughs> yeah, screw it. Let it fuel you. Anger makes you all the more lethal. Count on it. Those strange force fields are blocking access to much of the station, including afterlife. So after we complete our current objective, I'll be looking for a way to get around them. Enough talk. Is there anything else or can we move on? No, I think, I think that's it. We're done here. Although, even though I said let that anger fuel you, 
fuel you. Don't let it blind you at the same time. Don't uh, <laughs> forget things and just run in blind. Still use your head at the same time. That's all for now. Good. I'll meet you at the exit by the armory. All right, fair enough. Let's be moving out. And that's the wrong way. <laughs> good start, good start. I'm giving up. New inverters are the only answer. Good luck out there. Cheers. I like these guys. Been hanging around with the Alliance for so long now. I kind of, I kind of miss the old way of Mass Effect 2, hanging around in the dirts and the, the, the low lives. Or at least I kind of miss the how it was all like we're all like ragtag bunch of people to sort of thrown together for the greater cause. I guess I kind of miss that a little bit. The Wraith, the Tempest, the Wraith, the Tempest. Yes, very happy with both of that. Since our Nyrene's <laughs> essentially buggered off, looks like we have nothing really to upgrade with anyone. Let's move. What's your history with this game? Some mutually beneficial dealings and some occasional violence. The Talons weren't even a blip on our radar until the plague in 2185. Your little war against the other gangs left a vacuum. Not my intention. Their leader, Darius, took advantage of the situation and carved the Talons a bigger piece of the local drug trade. Are we enlisting them because they're good or because we need numbers? Their cannon fodder, we're using them because they're the only game in town. You're gonna let them know that? Relax, Shepard. This is how it works on Omega. Just let me do the talking and... Commander, Cerberus forces are scrambling. Looks like an attack on the Talons. Judging from column chatter, their priority target is in the area. Could be the Talon leader. Looks like we fight our way through Cerberus to get to them. Let's move. Fighting our way through Cerberus. That's definitely nothing new. Confirming Cerberus activity in your area. Let's see if I can hack their comm system. I'm liking this guy more and more. That's odd. Why would they leave crates of red sand lying around like this? Maybe they had something more important going on. Not Darius. Profit is the only thing that matters to him. Anything else can burn. Maybe being attacked by Cerberus was a little bit, uh, <laughs> more, uh, a bit more of a priority at this particular time. Hmm, controls. Looks like we're playing a uh, life-size Tetris again. One of these air shafts should lead us to Talon territory. Terminal, lift control. Hmm. Much better. Let's get our lift back down again. One moment, Aria, we're looting and the plundering. <laughs> you want my help? Then I'm gonna uh, bleed Omega dry in the process. Assault rifle, high velocity barrel. Well, not exactly something I'm ever gonna be using in this lifetime, but. I say every little help, say. If I didn't have that search everything attitude throughout the last two games, then uh, Shepard wouldn't be as overpowered as he is right now. Thank you very much. The terminal is active. Thank you, Commander. That's all right, train up. I, I mean, hacker. <laughs> Ah, great. Nice and dark. We haven't been in a nice dark room for a while. <laughs> Fantastic. We might as well be in open water again. Oh, I thought that was uh, an upgrade up there. No, just making sure there's nothing for the hacker. Don't want to leave anything uh, 
Air seal. No, don't want to do that just yet. See what else there is around here first. Mission report. We're almost done scouting this location. The surveillance drones indicate the detention center is on par with the last one we hit. But something feels off with the patrol patterns that display table is spitting out. I'd recommend another observation run before we try to extract the civilians. Hmm, that definitely doesn't sound like the work of Cerberus. Power's offline. There should be a control switch for the generator nearby. Looks like they were using this to observe the detainment centers. Hmm, the plot thickens. I was half expecting an ambush to be on the other side of that thing. That tower is the Talon outpost we're heading towards. Looks like the Talons are given as good as they get. <sighs> Definitely. You've just got to love that Omega scenery. It's just absolutely beautiful. But, <laughs> enough sightseeing. The Talons are... Yeah, they're holding their own, but uh, it will only be a matter of time before they're decimated. Understood. Oh, yeah, I see that salvage. More credits and everything for the Empire of Shepherd. No, nope. all right, let's move. I have, a, I feel the urge to shoot something now. Hmm. Oh, it looks like we're about to be spotted anyway, so... Aria, how about you hit a flare down there for me? Let's get rid of this uh, engineer before he sets up a turret. Yikes! Oh, what can I do down there? See if I can hit the other guy behind that wall with the pool at the same time. No, apparently not. Oh, where did these guys come from? Uh... I've got nothing to attack your shield yet. You, you just wait for a moment. Oh, in actual fact. Shepherd Punch! Yeah. That worked out nicely, I believe. My influence over station systems has just extended by 77%, Commander. Thank you. And we need all the, I think we're going to need all the backup we can get. It wasn't exactly like many of Arya's men survived the attack on this station. Oh, 150 experience points this time. Looks like you get them off the wall, you get more. Here comes fun! Boom, baby! <laughs> Whoa, hello, buddy! Well, looks like there's a guy getting attacked down there. Alright, quickly before we move on, let's take that. No idea what this is doing, but let's just let it do its thing. Oh, that's what that did. Alright, let's pull this guy's shields off, and you can hit a flare form. Oh, actually, no, let's hit a carnage there. Whoops, I thought I'd taken that guy's shield away. Yeah, you're welcome, buddy. Especially if you're going to be working with us, we're going to need you uh, full health. I can monitor enemy movement in sectors four through twelve now. Excellent. Our power is growing. Well, looks like we should get down there and join the fight. If I can get in the lift, that is. <laughs> oh, wow, this thing is moving slow. It's almost like the lift from the original Normandy. So. Elevator conversations, Aria. One time offer with Shepard, come on. Let's get nostalgic. Let's go Mass Effect 1 style. Damn it, nobody ever wants to join me in elevator conversations. Ok. 
carnage for me there, Aria. Oh, I see you standing there. Who do you think you're falling? I've got two pools now. Another carnage for me there, Aria. All right, I think this is just a matter of waiting. I could uh, <laughs> try and take this thing down. But if we just wait for Arius Flair to crop back up, and I think we're good to go. All right, stop shooting already. Boom! Where'd that other guy go? Ah, 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 none of that. Trying to set up a turret. Who do you think you are? Where is it? There he is. Oh, I'm going to take out that shield generator before I do anything. Whoa! No! Oh, hurry up! I need your flare back up! Where'd that guy go? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I see that back there. Yes, I know. Breakthrough Cerberus to forces. <laughs> I know exactly what I need to do there, game. Don't worry. Just taking my time. Just taking my time. You don't always have to cheese your way through with Vanguard tactics. Ah, Aria. Don't even let him out the door. <laughs> I just got a love flare. Whoops! Didn't mean to do Nova. <laughs> Alright, let's get moving. Any, th any loot or anything we can be taking around here? No, nope, no. Nope. Oh, medikit, I'll take that. No, other than that, a big fat nothing. Take care of the wounded and scavenge what you can. I want us out of here ASAP. You heard the boss. Move it. Looks like we found the Talon leader. My, my. Nyrene, aren't you full of surprises? Arya, the deception was necessary. I needed to figure out what your plans were. The people on Omega depend on us. I couldn't risk compromising our operation. Not exactly standard procedures for a street gang. When Cerberus invaded, the Talons were a mess. I brought... new direction. The General's been hunting us ever since. Right now, he's attacking one of our outposts. That's where I need to be. We're done here, boss. Right. Aria, Commander Shepard, whatever you're here for, the answer is no. Kindly escort yourselves off Talon territory. Whoa, 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 hold up there, Nyrene. Before we move on or do anything, she just totally pulled a Batman on those guys back there. Death from above! <laughs> Nyrene, you are just, yeah, you, as Aria said, you are full of surprises. We're here to help. We'll talk about it after we reach your outpost. That's a generous offer. Aria, does the Commander also speak for you? 
Not the way I would have put it, but that's the idea. All right, then. Come with me. Hmm, definitely not so much with a cloak and dagger, are you now? You've improved your biotics since last I saw you. You noticed the biotic grenades? You always did like blowing things up, given half a chance. <laughs> 